Welcome to St. Lucia Experience, recorded here in St. Lucia Beaches by Petrus Vivius and his favorite beach partet. Good morning, good morning, good morning. This is Petrus with your daily beach walk video. Look at the lovely birch here at the estuary mouth. But let's talk again about the migration of the estuary mouth. Okay, this bentonite mud bank that is here, it doesn't want to scour away that way. It needs to move north so that the whole system can migrate north. At this stage, it's a solid object that is, looks like an immovable object. If we had water cannons here, Minister Barbara, it could have been agitated and this lots of water that's draining out into the ocean now could have been put to good use. Right, as you saw in yesterday's video, the feedback from the floodplain farmers is not positive. The estuary water running down from the lake system is landing up on the farmers' farms. Another interesting phenomenon happening right now, right here, the people are picking up prawn. But what I was discussing is the fresh and the salt water that doesn't mix. So with the volume and the pressure of the fresh water exiting, I think when we get a high tide, the salt water comes over the fresh water and the fresh water exits underneath the incoming tide. So with all this fresh water that we've got here at the estuary mouth, it means that we don't have a functional estuary system. Although the mouth is open, it looks beautiful, the, ish, the marine interaction is not quite there yet. Okay guys, this is the little corner that I'm talking about where you will get your perch on the incoming tide. Even now, pretty much, yeah, will be perch. Light tackle. It's going to drift you quickly, so you're going to have to pull out and cast back in often. White bait, like prawn or squid. Um, on a small hook. Uh, number one or number two hook good afternoon good afternoon good afternoon yes it's Petrus and Pardet with your afternoon beach walk guys thank you for watching please subscribe to the channel less than 30% of the people are subscribed and yet we have to make professional videos on just an income of a third of what the channel is worth so that's not fair guys it's not fair unfortunately in South Africa they don't count your advertisement view if you're not subscribed to the channel it just works like that so please subscribe thank you there we've got a flock of Willenick stalk in a nice natural habitat not like in uh, Riches Bay where they sit in the harbour at Pelican Island on the road and the grass and the, among the litter here they in their natural habitat. Willy next talk. They didn't launch this morning here at St. Lucia. Where do they come from? That's where that boat comes from. Launch here with a bucket at the estuary mouth. Practicing the launches for the Rose Bowl competition. My most favorite bird, pelican. Scrubbing the mud with the feathers, basking in the afternoon sun. Welcome back, gentle giant. Welcome back. Dad already pushing in. Uh 
The diaper dead is looking for attention. She enjoyed the the chicken gizzards that Yuri bought her. It's now the second tray that she had. The first tray I shared with her, and I was walking back. We were walking back from the engine garage, and when we got to about Riefendun Pizza Restaurant, she was complaining that I'm having more than she was. And she snapped at my fingers every time I put them in the tray. So I had to wait until I get home and put the tray on the ground for her to finish. Got beautiful, beautiful bird species here. Yeah? The camera can't really identify them, so I'm just gonna shoot the footage and edit the sound in at home. That pretty much looks like a Goliath heron to me. And that's nothing else than yellow bull stalk. Some grey headed herons on the opposite bank. This is why I've been fighting so hard for mechanical maintenance. This is the type of stuff, if you pray for enough water to fix this, South Africa will be wiped out. Seriously. Guys, I'm a religious person, I believe in prayer. But you can't pray for steak and chips if you don't get up to go to work every day. There will always be people asking questions because they don't watch the videos they say they watch it but they use that slider underneath the video and pull it so you won't never know all the answers unfortunately you have to watch the whole video if you want to educate yourself even if it's per that part that we're just walking now this is the view from the ski boat club this is why the boats can't launch from the ski boat club see I hide the information so that I can get some money from the AdSense. This is why it's hidden in the videos. Now if you launch a boat here, either the tractor is going to have a long push pole, you're going to have a very unique engine design that can pump mud to propel a, a ski boat towards the ocean. Om jullie ek het gekry wat Pardet voor lief is. Sy vrak oor hierdie onderbultong. Pardet! Pardet! Kom kyk wat het om jullie vir jou gekoop, kom. Mmm, that like jy. Jy moet vir Muri dankie sê, jy kan nie jou gat op omdraai nie. Ek het nie geld om hierdie luxuries te koop nie. Is dit lekker papa, hier is nog jylle. Kom sê dankie vir Muri, daar sê. Jy word jylik grys he. Jy raak nou rechte ou vrou. Maar Muri, ek laak hierdie goeders baie. Gister het my pa sy pakkie met my gedeel en toe knor sy vir my, Muri. Maar dit het vir my geknor. Ja, ek het my pa geraas, hy eet al my bultong op. Ok, ek gaan vir hierdie bakkie op die vloer neersit, hoor. Dan kan jy dit self eet. Nou hoef jy nie so te staan en bedel nie. Ah, sy. Jy is nie een bedelaar nie, jy is nie een stratrak nie, jy kan kry wat jy wil hee, ok? Geniet het my sy kind. Thank you for watching, please subscribe to the channel. Every subscription help to support me and Pardet here on St. Lucia History. Thank you very much, goodbye.